Hey guys, snuck into Pine's awesome shop here on a Saturday. The XMR Renegade just came in last night on the truck, or yesterday afternoon on the truck, and they pulled her out of the crate and got her mostly together here. I just want to do just a super quick video of it in stock form before we start throwing some mods at it. They got a brand new floorboard design. Actually, this is all metal and it's a lot narrower. There's so much room for 30s now. I'm sure a guy can run 32s with no issues now. And they got cut fender flares here. Still gonna help a little bit with the mud and they still look really good. This snorkel set up here. They got the CVT exhaust coming up here and then it routes back around and then actually blows on your engine exhaust to kind of keep things cool there. And then you got your CV intake and engine intake kind of in the same molded piece but two separate intakes. There's where it goes into the airbox for the engine and then that one goes down for your CVT intake. This front bumper, actually the bumper looks really great but we're gonna have to change that out. We're gonna be running a rad relocate. But down here, like this is all metal here, kind of like a bash plate and then they got, they come with your front and center skid plates already on. This is actually a really, really nice model. You got your larger 1000 XMR rear diff, all the extra metal parts, bumpers front and rear, snorkels, <laughs> put this, this frickin' powder strap here, mud strap, I don't know how well that's gonna work, but we'll try her out. Anyways, just a quick shot of how things are looking. We're still kind of deciding on just a couple last build details. We're gonna release uh, basically everything we're gonna do to it here right away. But like I said, there's still a couple last little things that we're still trying to work out. Here's the tires we're gonna be running. This new Silverback MT2s. Just a gnarly looking tire. Look at that sidewall. We're gonna see how those babies do in the Muskeg. They're almost identical height as the 30s. Well, these are unmounted though, mind you. So mounted with air, they'd probably be a little taller. But they're supposed to be a nice smooth ride. And like I said, that sidewall should really help in the ruts. And then we'll see how these big lugs do in the Skeg. Super excited to get this baby out. See what she can do. Get all our mods on, get a nice custom wrap on. Exhaust, clutches, rad relocate. Just adding to what already is almost, I wouldn't say perfect from the factory, but holy, they sure did a lot with this model. She's ready to go. Anyways, thanks for watching. Just a quick, quick view of everything and stay tuned. We'll have uh, all the build details updated soon. Talk to you later.